All right, so this is going to be my new optimization prep video. Uh, make sure you do this before your appointment. It's very important that you do this. It'll save a lot of time, and if you don't do it, I'll just cancel your appointment. It's nothing personal, obviously. It's just make sure you get this done. So first, you're going to need an 8, 16, or 32 gig memory stick. Make sure it's not more or less. Less it won't fit. More can you can just run into problems. Um, next, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go here to the TechBench website that's in uh, the description. You select Windows Final, 21H1, Windows 10, English, and 64-bit version. And you're just going to hit download here. Now we'll start downloading. Next, you're going to go to the Rufus website, and you're going to download Rufus 3.14. Then you're going to go into the Google Drive that's linked, and you're going to download the Shack and Optimization Pack. And then you're going to search for your motherboard. If you don't know your motherboard or you're just unsure of like the exact model, all you have to do is type in do command prompt. You open a new CMD window and type this command here. I'll leave it in the description. It'll pop up with your product. So you can just grab this, paste it in, go to your motherboard's website, and yours might look different than mine. You're just looking for the support tab for your motherboard, the BIOS, and you're going to grab the latest BIOS file. Obviously, one that has the most recent release date. You're going to download that. Once that's downloaded, once everything's downloaded, you're going to extract it all to the desktop. Just make sure you have Rufus, the ISO file, which is the 21H1 file, my optimization pack. And then if you go into your motherboard file, you just grab the, it's a .cap or .a32, whatever it is. Just make sure you drag that onto the desktop here. You're then going to open Rufus. Just hit no on allow updates. It will automatically select the USB that's plugged in, or just make sure you select the right one might be named different than this. It might just be like named USB or whatever. Mine's already formatted for Windows. So that's why it's called this drive here. You're going to hit select. You're going to go to the desktop. and You're going to select the ISO file. Leave everything else. Don't touch anything else. And you're going to hit start. I'm going to say this, like, everything will be destroyed, meaning it's going to wipe the USB stick, and you're going to hit OK. Let it do its thing. If it's hanging at 99% or whatever, don't touch it. Just let it be until it's done. Once it's done, you'll get a pop-up. It'll say, like, make sure you disable, like, safe boot or whatever. Just hit OK on that and close the window. You should now have, like, two things, or maybe it's just one. It depends. And inside the, once you open it up, it should look something like this. What you're going to do is you're going to drag the, drag the zip file on here, the optimization pack, and you're going to drag your BIOS file over here as well. Make sure you leave this zipped. And that's it. That's the prep for the USB stick. That's all you need to do. For Valorant, what I need you to do is I need you to open Valorant. I need you to send me a screenshot in the range with no bots spawned. And I need you to enable your game to render latency, render latency, and game latency, as well as FPS as text values. And send me a screenshot of that. So in the top left, you see FPS, game to render latency, render latency, and game latency, or whatever order it's in. Make sure they're all text values. Send me a screenshot as you, once you go into the range, pull your knife out, don't spawn any bots. Just face the range as you are, like as you would select a character, don't move and send a screenshot of that. That's what I used to benchmark against. Then you're going to, you're going to send a screenshot of that. Then you're going to type in DXDIAG into your windows. Hit enter. If this pops up, just hit yes. And you're going to send me, the sys you're going to send me a screenshot of this screen right here the system tab which tells me what processor you have and the display tab which tells me which gpu you have if you have an amd gpu then enable the you won't have game to render latency and stuff like that just enable all the values like cpu frame time cpu game time whatever there is there if you have an nvidia gpu just make sure it's just game to render render and game latency and fps obviously that's it. That's all you have to do. Make sure you have this memory stick ready and make sure you send me those screenshots before your appointment on Discord. It's S, capital S, lowercase h, a, k, k, n, like this. Right. Find it. Right here. Hashtag 5054. Also, this is my tweaking Discord. You can join this. People talk about different things. And there's also my, I also post the NVIDIA updates. As like for NVIDIA, if you should update your drivers or not, as well as the prep links are all here as well if you need to grab them. That's it. Make sure this is done before your appointment.